Hey, what's up YouTube? Casual Yugi stuff here. Welcome back to another Yu-Gi-Oh! video. Today is my first video of 2021. Happy New Year to you all. Thank you so much for joining us for the year of 2020, the crazy year that it was. Very, very uh, much high and low uh, for sure, but we managed to make it to uh, 2021 with surpassing 3,000 subscribers, so massive thank you to everybody. And here's to an even bigger 2021 year, guys, so let's see what we can do. In today's video, I will be giving away a couple of cards, well, three to be exact. I'm giving away some pretty good cards as the first giveaway of 2021, guys. I'm going to be giving away to one lucky winner. All that you need to do to win is leave a comment down below, like this video, and also be a subscriber of the Casual Crew. And I'll be giving away a Red Eyes Black Dragon, Blue Eyes White Dragon, and a Kyber Sticker, guys. This is the giveaway prize for one lucky winner today. All that you got to do, as mentioned, is leave a like, comment, and be a subscriber, guys. And uh, basically, what I'll be doing in today's video is a bit different. So we have had a very, very successful year uh, in the Casual Yugi Stuff uh, community, guys. You've been awesome, as I mentioned. 3,000 subscribers have been hit. But I've realized we have been, obviously, producing good content. But I want to go the extra mile, guys. I want to make sure you're enjoying it uh, the most possible. We're obviously keeping it casual all at the same time. So what I've decided to do in this video is just showcase a couple of items that I will be looking to um, part ways with, so sell, um, in relation to, to gather some funds so I'm able to channel more uh, of my obviously time, funds and effort into creating better content so I can actually go out and, and upgrade my, my you know quality of content. So guys, basically what I'm going to be showing you, for example, is a lot of cards that we basically packed fresh and put straight into soft sleeves. I'll be looking to, uh, to sell effectively, guys. And if any of you do want any of these cards, all that you've got to do, leave a comment down below on this video, hit me up on Instagram, link below to my Instagram, which should be very, very fun for you guys to hit me up. I'm sure I'm going to get inundated with, with inquiries. But anyway, guys, without further ado, I'm going to show some really cool pieces that I'm going to be, um, as I say, selling in today's video. So let's get straight into it, guys. I think the majority of these cards I basically pulled uh, pack fresh on the channel. A uh, lot of ultimate rares, if you can't tell already. Um, massive, well, fan of ultimate rares, as you uh, well know by now, guys. The ultimate rare king. You guys call me. So these are basically quite a few bulk hollows that I've just packed over the many, many openings that we've done uh, on and off the channel. Uh, predominantly sort of Zexal. Uh, that's a cool Red Eyes Toon Dragon there, first edition. These are all pretty much pack fresh mint condition, guys. So if any of you do want any of these cards, let me know. A couple of Medulches there. Golden Apples. Chaos Hunter. That's from when we got the Ghost Rare Odin. Uh, lots of lots of hollows guys I've basically put uh, pack fresh and guys this is quite interesting now because we've got some of the uh, if you remember my three no 2,000 subscriber special we got the magic ruler first edition box opening which is incredible we packed relinquished and toon summons gold massive spoiler but check that video out I've got loads of commons guys from magic ruler these are all gradable I've, I've gone through them these are the best of the conditions so these are all pack fresh mint condition First edition 2002 Magic Ruler common cards, guys. So if any of you, let's say, really like Snake Fang or really like October Sir, let me know and I'll be happy to obviously part ways with them and, and get them sold to you at a good price. So just go through the last bit of bulk here that we've got. We're starting slow, but I'm going to show some awesome cards. Hungry Burger, one of the classics. I'm sure that one of you all will probably want Hungry Burger, guys. Quite a lot of cards here, as you can tell just all up for sale because i wanted to psa grade all of these but it's going to take a lot of time and perhaps a bit too much money to, to get those all graded so yeah that's the um first lot that i wanted to show you basically the ulti bulk and magic ruler bulk so we'll just put those down secondly what's really really cool and what i'm going to get a lot more of coming in soon are basically these screw down uh, cases for cards now these are just for Yu-Gi-Oh cards, so they're specifically made for Yu-Gi-Oh card sizes. I've been doing this with Mr. Joe Wheeler. Uh, basically, as, I, as you can see, Bow Dragon in here has been placed perfectly. This won't move around or be damaged if you were to drop it, for example. So if you've got a very special card, uh, such as this Bow Dragon, you can put it inside of here. But I'm, what I'm actually looking to produce is more of these cases, guys. Mr. Joe Wheeler is in production to see if he can create a lot more for us. So we can obviously distribute them. And what I could even do is get an engrave here of, of Kashi Yugi stuff or, or of, of your own name or make it a bit more personalized. So that's definitely an option as well if you wanted um, some of that. And not only do we have the card version of that, but we also have, 
what I think you guys pro probably will love the most is the booster pack uh, sleeves, guys. Basically, taking a couple of examples here with me today, I've got the uh, Magician's Force and Blue Eyes White Dragon. So let's take a look at the, this is my only first edition pack, by the way. Just for reference, the pack isn't for sale, the casing is for sale, guys. If you wanted any of these cases, let me know. Hit me up on Instagram, I can place an order in for you. Um, I don't think they're that expensive, but they're such good quality plexiglass, guys. Uh, if this drops, absolutely will not damage. It might crack, but I don't even think it will crack. It just looks so, so nice. You can really admire it. I've sleeved up the pack inside of here as well. Um, so yeah, these are really, really awesome. Probably my two rarest first edition sealed booster packs there that I just wanted to show you guys. And they're well protected uh, in these um, booster pack cases, really. So that's really nice. So let me know if any of you would be interested in ordering some of those i definitely would love to help you out there and then guys we're going to move into a couple of interesting cards here i'm going to be selling some actually uh, really really cool uh, psa graded cards i've kept in my uh, collection for quite a while i'm only going to be shifting these at the right price but feel free to to offer down below so i'm actually looking to sell an arcane magician assault mode ultimate rare population of one this is the only in the world last time I checked that was PSA graded 10. As you can see, a very stunning, very beautiful card. Ultimate rare. Kind of looks like Dark Paladin, I, I used to say, but really cool. Then a Doom Kaiser Dragon. Uh, very nice. Ulti again. I actually packed this on the channel a while ago with a friend. Titanial Princess of Camellius. That was the 1000 subscriber special. Or was it 1500 subscriber special? No, it was the 1000 subscriber special where we packed this uh, beauty. She's really gorgeous. And then I'm also giving away a very rare um, off-center OC, Venomin on the King of Poisonous Snakes. You can see how off-center that card is massively, guys. That's actually quite rare. You don't get that every day with PSA. And the ultimate rare on this Euro print looks absolutely amazing. So if you're a, uh, a reptile uh, fan from the Tactical Evolution um, Snake Theory um, Viper season, that's really, really cool. You definitely probably want to pick this up. It's quite a unique piece. So yeah, guys, those are the PSA cards I'm looking to, um, you know, reinvest. So obviously sell out to the community. So if any of you guys want some of these cards, these are all graded by myself and packed uh, other than Arcanite Magician, let me know. But I'm also looking to shift. This is actually quite sad. I don't really want to, but I'm going to see if I can get any good offers on my Queen's Knight, Jack's Knight and King's Knight. Now, these are all Ultimate Rare, all first edition european ultimate rare and what i love about it is we've got the 10 the 9 and the 8 so in consecutive not consecutive serial numbers these two are consecutive 127 128 um this one's 173 but it's so cool that we have um the 8 9 and 10 jack queen and king it should be king 10 jack 9 and queen 8 but it's the inverse of that it's still quite cool i think so yeah guys i'm going to be selling this as a whole set not as individuals so please let me know if you'd be interested in the Jacks, Queen and King's Knight set and uh, hopefully we will be able to work something out guys. Definitely a set I'll be sad to sell but at the same time it's not ideally what I'd like to have in my ultimate collection. Alright so with the PSA cards out of the way guys I'm going to show you another very special uh, set that I'm looking to. It's kind of like an incompleted set basically um, this is a very spe special card that I'll be actually selling. But I've got quite a few, this is an LOB first edition um, European pack, which I've just put in a sleeve, it looks quite cool. But what these are, are all, basically, quite a few LOB first edition commons from the LOB European series, so LOBE. All of the commons were packed fresh, the rares I've had in my collection, they're sort of light play, but all the commons are near mint. Um, if anybody watching this video is looking to collect LOB first edition European, and needs you know the majority of these let me know i'm again telling these as a collection you could say uh, but i've got like metal dragon spike cedra man eater bug has a little bit of a scratch there but still light play condition very very cool quite rare and uh, left leg of the uh, forbidden one left leg of the exodia so that's just got a little bend in that corner but it looks really really nice and that's coming all together and obviously if you're looking to purchase these as well you might be after my psa2 blue eyes white dragon which i've decided to sell i was going to regrade it but the time it takes to just regrade stuff it's just too long and keeping it as a, as it is as a psa2 i think is quite cool because it's a terrible grade but it looks awesome slabbed 
Um, so yeah guys, that can come with this set of Blue Eyes cards, that can come as its own. Let me know if you'd be uh, interested in picking up any of those guys. So, that's what we have for the Blue Eyes. Let's just go into my binder now guys. So, any cards that you see in this binder will again all be for sale. Um, just because I am, as I say, reinvesting any sort of funds that we do make from this video into future videos. So it means I'll be able to buy more product this year. I really want to involve myself more in modern Yu-Gi-Oh! and maybe pack a couple of Starlights. I know we've been enjoying ourselves with Ultimate Rares, but if we can get some Starlights, that'd be really, really good. So these are the cards I'm selling. Let's just put my hand there in a good, in a comfortable position without knocking over it. There we go, I think that looks good. So we've got Dark Magician, these are the Dawless Pack Yugi cards that I pulled. They are damaged, they have a strange factory line on, on the back of each. So these are some cool cards here as well. Lava Golem, First Edition, Injection Fairy Lily. Majority of these cards are like near mint condition, but a lot will be played like this Jinzo is destroyed. Um, so is Gate Guardian, for example. I'd say the average can overall condition is light play of these cards, I'd say. This Serpent Knight is first edition and pretty minty. Obelisk is, again, sort of light play. Um, Vampire Lord. Exodia, that's near mint. Master Collection. Some cool cards here. Dreadmaster is light play. Ultimate Rare, first edition. Uh, feel free to pause the video if you do see anything, guys, and um, want to make a list for me and hit me up on, on, on Instagram. Some cool cards in this page as well. These two are mint, pack fresh from our opening on the channel last year. Good times. Enemy controller has a bit of a crease in here, but it's still first edition. Very nice. Uh, what else do we have? A couple of ultis and ghosts now. So Odin. That's not the Odin we packed, but it is still a very good condition Odin. Let's see if we can get it under the camera. There we go. It's quite difficult with ghost rares. Uh, a couple more cards here. These are really rare, sort of Stardust Overdrive first editions. This is a North American Blue Eyes, which is kind of beat up. I think it's been laminated, but still um, a cool Blue Eyes nonetheless. Red Nova Dragons. Uh, Draco Equist first edition has a massive crease on the back. Jump Berserker. Uh, number 107, I don't think I'll be selling uh, Galaxy Ice Tachyon Dragon, but still... A, uh, a cool card that I wanted to include in the binder. That's probably the one card I wouldn't sell out of this. Glow Neos, first edition, ultimate rare. That's for sale. I think I've got that around about $100 I'm selling that for. Maybe slightly less, but it's still good good value. It's like a very light play condition. Um, some other cards here. Unlimited Honest, Ill Blood, Unlimited Doomfire Ulti, classic. I think that's up for sort of $40, $50. Quite good value guys just everything's going to be reinvested into the channel so if you do want to help and support and pick something up that's all that's going to go to is a good cause it's back in the channel straight away so a couple of crush card viruses hopefully not going to see any of these in 2021 um the dark world set ulti magnet warrior set these are european a couple of other uh, cards here first edition premature burial which is european a couple more cards there and a few more guardian girl first dead cyber dragon and a final page of synchros so that's the binder guys let me know if there's anything there that interests you and we're going to the final um item of today's video i have several of these so if you do want one don't worry there's not just this one i do have a couple of these and i'm talking about first edition metal raiders booster boxes these are portuguese booster boxes but they are factory sealed you can get gate guardian or thousand dragon in these there's no set uh, card that you can pull out of the secret rares so one of the two will be not guaranteed per box but you, it's random so i think out of the case that i've got i think it's maybe eight or nine secret rares per box so it's quite a high ratio now don't quote me on that but it's got high i think it's almost a one and two Maybe slightly more than the one in two chance of getting a secret. But if you wanted a first edition metal raided box, these are still quite affordable. Um, hit me up on Instagram. I will be able to sort you out with a few of these. I think I've got a limited quantity, but I do have a few that I'm looking to sell. So if you wanted a sealed box, whether it's just for your collection, whether you want to crack one open for the nostalgia, or whether you just want to exactly purchase one and, and gift it to somebody, um, that's all up to you guys. Let me know if you wanted a metal raiders first edition portuguese boost box i'm so tempted to crack and open one of these on the video 
but I'm going to restrain myself and let you guys enjoy it. So guys, that's a little bit about what I'm selling and what I'm looking to recoup some funds for future YouTube videos here on the Casual YouTube channel. Um, let me know guys, my casual crew, if you wanted anything in here, nothing will be too expensive. I'm going to obviously try and be as fair as possible when I'm selling my stuff because obviously it's going to you guys. Who else would I want my cards to go to? They live on with you. And remember for today's video anyway, we have a giveaway. It's quite a good one. We've got a Red Eyes Black Dragon. These are creased as hell, but still cool cards. Blue Eyes White Dragon there as well. That's European and a Kyber sticker to go with your blue eyes. So if you enjoyed today's video, guys, please leave a like, subscribe and comment down below. And this was Casual Yugi Stuff. I hope to see you all in future videos on the channel. This year is going to be a great year. Let's keep it casual and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye for now. Take care. Peace. Blue eyes, white dragon. There we go. We just. Yeah, guys, the ice bones of the dragon. Go, It's too far for us to soldier! It's a lucky